Leo's insights are presented to challenge, inform, and encourage you in your quest to break free from school-based approaches to education. Building upon a foundation of unschooling, we sincerely hope these insights help you to consider how education can be truly unlimited. It seemed to come upon us very quickly. And by March of 2020, we were all being told to do things none of us were happy about. We complied in the hope of securing health and safety for everyone. COVID-19 was the worst pandemic since the influenza of 1918-20, which we were told killed nearly 100 million people because they were just not as smart as us. All we had to do was follow the experts and it would soon be all over. Yeah, right. Nobody knew what was happening. We defaulted to doing what we were told, even if the rules seemed to be constantly changing. We were told it would only require two weeks to flatten the curve. I instinctively wondered about this curve, <laughs> as it was nowhere near flattened after two weeks, nor after two months, nor two years for that matter. If there was a consistency of this pandemic, it was the indescribable inconsistencies. Politicians flip-flop, help professionals bark orders and change their minds, and enforcement could be brutal, if not downright cruel. Actually, there was one thing that was most definitely consistent. Fear. It was everywhere, and it was masterfully used to manipulate the masses in ways not previously seen on such a grandiose and global scale. The most disconcerting thing to me was the extreme level of oppression which resulted from manipulating people's fear of COVID-19. Even though I could not claim I knew what was going on, I had no doubt where all this was coming from, and it could not be from God. Fear comes straight from hell, and I determined I would not be a part of it. Although the fallout of COVID-19 caused upheaval in most everyone's life. 2020 proved to be a very good year for us. Not only did our previous personal issues get resolved, but the stay-at-home orders and online programming created a perfect opportunity for the advancement of home education as an alternative to going to school. Things for EU were good, perhaps too good. And we secretly wondered if this upswing would last. The lesson today, God is not the author of fear. I repeat, God is not the author of fear. Fear is the opposite of faith. In fact, they are equal opposites. More faith equals less fear. And more fear equals less faith. Anything employing fear is manipulative and authoritarian. Using fear to measure what was happening. I saw COVID-19 for what it was. We trust you were blessed by today's presentation. For more helpful information to guide you in your home education journey, please visit educationunlimited.ca and leogomal.com. Be sure to like us and share us on Facebook.